Whoa. What the hell? like someone took a giant ice cream scoop to it. I mean, I'd heard what had happened, but... Yeah. None of that prepared me for the reality of how it looks in person. That place you can see in the distance must be Crossbell City. But what's that blue barrier surrounding it? Well, according to info I got from the Guild, Crossbell's got some kind of new power. And we're talking big absolute power no one's got a clue how the damn thing works though it sounds terrifying yeah anyway that power was what allowed them to do this to Gorelia. it's also what's putting up that barrier around the city thanks to that no other country on the continent Maribonia included can touch them the concept alone is so out of this world I thought my source was just messing with me but now yeah, you can't doubt what's right before your eyes. Please, I'm willing to bet Ouroboros is involved in whatever happened there. Wouldn't surprise me. Whatever happened in Crossbell, it happened at about the same time the war broke out in Erebonia. So there's every chance they're behind both. <sighs> Unbelievable. There's a lot for us to take in, and a lot of questions that need answering. Right now, I think we should focus on reuniting with the 4th Armored Division. We can think about what to do next once we've met with them. Yeah, you're right. The Proving Ground is on the opposite side of the fortress, right? Then we should head farther inside and... <gasps> what was that sound? Don't move, Machias! Wh why <laughs> what the hell? It was a new model mine. <laughs> Thought so. Come out, you two! I know you're there! <laughs> oh, uh, you noticed. You haven't lost your touch, Fee. Weren't those two in Heimdall during the National Address? They were. And they were with Duke Cayenne and LeGram. I knew it. Long time no see, Fee. Uh, yearish, I guess? <laughs> Still pint size, but you've grown a bit taller, at least. Her muscular strength, reflexes, and agility have also remarkably improved. There's no stopping the flow of time, I suppose. Careful, guys. That's Zephyr's emblem on their jackets. Wait, Zephyr? That's the Jaeger Corp he was with! There's no need to be so on guard. We just want to enjoy our long-awaited reunion with an old friend and comrade. How about you, Fee? Miss us? You're the same as ever. Although, if you keep using traps to kick off reunion parties, you won't have any friends left before long. Ah, don't be like that. That's just my way of saying hi. Thought it'd bring you back to the good old days when you used to play with them for practice. 
And I only set the one, so give me a break, okay? Well, whatever. You look good, Leo. I'm glad. Well, we haven't changed half as much in the span of a year as you did. Adults have a lot less room for growing, after all. I'm already 15, you know. Where have you two been all this time? I tried to find out where you'd gone after you all disappeared, but it was like you vanished from the continent. Who knows? Anyway, uh, let's let the past stay in the past, yeah? So, uh, you up to anything fun? We're giving the Noble Alliance guys lessons on how to pilot those soul dots better these days. It ain't the most exciting gig in the world. They're not interested in learning from a couple of Jaegers, but they suck at piloting them even when they do listen, so whatever. Oh. These two are Jaegers, right? They sure don't seem that way. Well, they're old friends of Fee's. They might seem friendly, but don't let your guard down. Zephyr's up there together with the Red Constellation as one of the strongest cores in Zemuria. They're the real deal. Could've fooled me. So these are the people Fee lived with before she joined us. Okay, I think we better wrap up the family reunion. Wish we could catch up with you a little while longer. But unfortunately, we've got a job to do, and work takes priority. To confirm, you have no intention of withdrawing. None. We're here with conflicting goals. That makes us enemies. And that gives us no choice but to fight with everything we've got. <laughs> Trust you to know how this works. What kinds of weapons are those? A blade rifle and a mechanized gauntlet? All right, let's have some fun. You ready, kiddos? Fight with everything you have. Unless you want to end up in as many pieces as this fortress. Oh boy. Okay, now I can believe they're really Jaegers. These two served as regimental commanders back in the core. Our odds of winning are 20% at best. Don't hold back. I'm not sure I like those odds. Like them or not, we have no choice but to bet on those odds. Let's give this all we got! Started. Show us what you can do. Okay. Gonna ha! Take this, Imperio! It's my turn! Analyzing enemy attack patterns. I've got it! It's my turn! Hang in there, everyone! Yes. Let's move! All right, let's do this. Me. My turn. Here I go. Yeah. Go. Have some freebies on me. Too slow. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right. Keep it up, everyone! My turn. Hope you're- <laughs> Okay. I'll handle it. Here goes! 
aren't bad. Okay. My turn. Monsters! They're still holding back, too. Not bad. For being only students, you show great potential. Your academy training seems to have paid off. It's not easy to keep up with feet. <laughs> you think they can handle us if we kicked it up a notch? I'm game if you are, Leo. Who else is up for round two? Ah, should have known they weren't even trying. That 20% is looking more like zero right now. What do you all think you're doing? S Soul Dots? The one at the front is like the Soul Dot Scarlet was piloting near Trista. What are they doing coming from the by road? I get it now. The attack from the Transcontinental Railroad was just a diversion. They were intending to launch a surprise attack from the flank all along. What are civilians doing here? Or Zephyr for that matter? First you disappear when you're supposed to be taking part in our operation, and then you wind up here? Be gone! You're in our way! <sighs> Round two is gonna have to wait, I guess. Bummer. I was hoping to get a chance to try my luck against that famous knight, too. I had some traps specially made for it and everything. You'll get your chance eventually. We should stand down for now. 
and watch from above. What should we do? We don't have to worry about Zeno and Leo now, but we're not out of danger yet. After how much trouble it was to defeat one soldat back near Trista, not out of danger is an understatement. Yeah, and it was one of those against all of Class 7. Stand back, everyone. Are you...? Wait... You're gonna call Valimar? It's the only choice we have! Heed my call. Valimar! Valimar the, the Ashen, Ashen Knight! Knight! And a ghost! What's that sound? It's coming from the sky over there! Is it an Imperial Army airship? What in the world? Is that the thing they mentioned in the report? Came. Whoa, this is amazing! Sorry for leaving this to you, Reen. We're counting on you. Right! Okay, I shouldn't need to worry about fighting on borrowed time like before. We're up against an awful lot of them, though. If only we had some kind of weapon. Oh, that won't be an issue. There are plenty of potential weapons right there in front of us. <laughs> Clever. If that's what you have in mind, we'd best concentrate our attacks on one of them and snatch it away as quickly as possible. That's the plan. Valimar, here we go! Acknowledged. All right, you ready? Now! 
destructive impact! Done, Rain. I'm just glad that it worked. This is where the real battle begins. Yeah, that's our Rain. That was quite an impressive plan. Huh? Are your arcuses resonating with one another? Go ahead and show me what you can do! Gotcha! It's my turn! Handle this? We'll do. Try at least. Will do.
This can't be happening! How can it be this strong? Well, what's it to be? We can do this all day if you're still not ready to give up! Oh, Rain! He's got this. That he does. He's turned this whole situation around. Sir! This battle isn't over yet! We still have the advantage in numbers! We can surround him! Victory will be ours! Enough! What? Th that sounds like... Diversion, and I suggest you turn and run off with your tails between your legs if you don't want to share their fate. Unless you men think you can handle the might of the Fourth Armored Division. <sighs> Curse you, Craig! Fine. If that's how you want to play, we'll just have to call. Slippers. Are you all right, sir? A sniper? Where are they? What just happened? Who the... I've taken out the commander's sensor. What's the situation with Zephyr? Both are standing by at 5 o'clock. No signs of movement. Acknowledged. Ignore them for now. Focus your attention on the highway instead. Yes, ma'am. If she can aim that precisely from that far away, we're likely in her sights, too. The Icy Maiden has certainly earned her reputation. Wouldn't want to try my luck against her. Not right now, anyway. Not much we can do while she's all the way over there. Besides, uh, I think it's about time we called it a day. We're taking off, Fee. See you some other time, okay? Be sure to keep up with your training. You'll need it if you want to make it through this war unscathed. Bye-bye. Who do those damn Jaegers think they are to retreat without orders? All units, fall back! We're returning to the Twin Dragons Bridge! Yes, sir! Phew. Looks like we're safe now. Hey, nice work out there. Whew. I felt uncomfortably close to death one or four too many times. At least it's all over with now. Dad! Thank goodness you're all right! Elliot! That's the famous Craig the Red, huh? Looks like the real model of a scary-ass military officer. About that. That's what everyone thinks at first. Oh! My beloved gift from Adios! <laughs> why, why did you talk? Come here into your father's loving embrace! No way, Dad! I mean, I'm glad you haven't changed, but I... Uh, Dad! Nonsense! You were raised in my arms, my boy. What's another two or three minutes more? I can tell you've lost some weight, but you're otherwise as fit as your fiddles. Oh, it's so good to see you again. <laughs> you too. But you're seriously hurting me now. Please loosen your grip some. That thing I said earlier, I take it back. <laughs> yeah, everyone reacts like that. Elliot seems really happy, though. Yeah, 
It's great to see them together again. I'm pleased to see that everything went well. Uh. I thought it was you. Looks like you're from the Railway Military Police. Then you must be... It's a pleasure to see you again, Captain. <laughs> Likewise. And, yes, sir. I'm Captain Claire Revelt of the RMP. It sounds as though we have plenty to discuss. Perhaps in a more fitting location. Follow me, if you would. <laughs>